If you're in the market for a riding vest, well, the Legion Tac vest from Fox could be just what you're looking for. All right, everyone, thank you for checking in. I am Chase, and today we're giving you a closer look at the new Legion Tac vest from Fox Racing. If you're in the market for one of these, I think Fox did a good job with this. Now, when it comes to a vest, we have a lot of riders here at Rocky Mountain that wear these, and there's a couple things about these that riders really like. One, you're getting a hydration bladder that comes included, so you've got your water. But another great benefit to a vest versus just a hydration bladder or a hydration pouch or backpack is that you don't have to carry all the weight just on the back. With the vest, you can distribute that weight a little bit more evenly so you're carrying more weight in the front so it's not all loaded in the back. So if that's something that you struggled with in the past where you're getting too much weight on the back, you want to distribute some of that a little bit better, a vest is a really good option. So with this, as far as sizing goes, Ashton that is wearing it right now, he is about 5 foot 8, 170 pounds, he has a 40 inch chest. He is wearing this small medium, so it fits him well. You've got these three straps right down the middle. These have room to grow. You've also got two straps on the side. We'll show you those in a second. Those have a lot of adjustability. So this thing does expand pretty well. So for me, I'm five foot seven, about 175 pounds. I have a 42 inch chest. I also fit for the size small medium. It fits me great. And we did have Ashen try this on over top of a rooster reflector. We had him put on the Fox race frame. So with that, this still fit him just fine. So Keep that in mind if you're wearing this over top of roost reflector, I would say just go with your normal size because you do have a lot of room to adjust this and have it grow. So looking at it, you've got good construction. You're going to have a 600 denier ripstop fabric as the main construction. A lot of molly webbing on this thing so you can get a lot of additional items attached if you do want to. Right now you can see the SIP2 comes down the right shoulder. You could do it over the left if you want to. You do have this little magnetic clip keep that in place. You got a 45 degree bite valve, which is nice. Also, what's nice about the bite valve is you can turn this off and on, which I'm a fan of. I've had hydration packs in the past where the bite valve didn't turn off and it would just leak on me when I was riding. So I like that you can do that. But he's got over the right side, you can see all the molly webbing. What I like though is that on the left side, if Ashton wanted to, he could put a radio right here, maybe clip on a GPS. And now we'll talk about all the pockets. So as you work your way down the chest area, on both sides right here, you've got these little hidden pockets. So you can see with that, I can almost get my whole hand inside there. You've got one on each side. You've got this small chest pocket right here. And with this one, if you had say a Garmin InReach Mini or a smaller GPS communicator, you could put it inside there. You've got a little key clip right here as well. And then you've got one of these big pockets on each side. So those are gonna be large pockets to open up. So with that opening, you can see, you do have a little mesh divider in there as well. We already talked about the three straps or the three buckles going down the middle. Ashton turned 90 degrees, lift up that arm for me. So these are your two straps that are coming across the side here. Like I said, if Ashton wanted to, he could really cinch that down. But again, if you're wearing a roost deflector underneath that, you can really open those up and get a lot of growth there. You've got mesh there to help this thing breathe. Now face the back for me, Ashton. So what I like is that in the back here, up at the top, they didn't put anything there. And why I like that is that if you wear a neck brace, this will give you good combat compatibility with that. You've got your hydration pouch right here going down the center. Like I said, it comes with a two liter hydration bladder. It's a hydro pack. What I like though is it has the sliding lock, the sliding closure on the top. Those do not leak. I've had great luck with those. Easy to pull that thing out, fill it back up, put it back in there. So that's your bladder compartment. You got another zipper pocket right here about halfway down. See, I can easily get my whole hand inside there. Lots of molly webbing here on the back as well. Again, if you want to attach additional items. And then on each side, right and left, you have one of these tall pockets. You can see I can get my whole hand inside there. That to me is a great location for maybe, you know, some tire spoons, some of your longer items that you want to take with you, some tools. That's going to be a great spot. And inside there, you do have an additional divider. You can see I put my finger inside there. So there is a way to organize some items inside this pocket. All right, I should turn and face back the front for me. All right, and that is it. That is the TAC, or the Legion TAC vest from Fox Racing. If you're in the market for one of these, it's a really good option. I also do want to point out that Ashton is wearing the Fox Legion gear, which is their off-road gear. He's got the FL FMF collab edition going on right now. This is limited, but in any case, it's awesome looking. But with the Legion gear, a little bit more durable fabric on the sleeves of the jersey with the pant. Bomb proof, it's one of my favorites for off-road riding. You've got big zip vents on the thighs. You've also got a zipper pocket. That's just gonna help you store some additional items with you. So if you are looking for some off-road gear, the Legion, you gotta check that stuff out.
But if you have questions or comments, you want to get those answered. And remember, this is a part of our fit guarantee. So if you get this vest, if you don't like how it fits, you can send it back a brand new unused condition. We'll give you free shipping both ways on your first exchange for either the same vest or a completely different one just to make sure you get the size and the fit that you are looking for. I am Chase, and we'll see you on the trails. Thank you.